episode of Tug RC. Today we're going to be doing an unboxing on the FTX Outlaw. I got this off my uh, local uh, uh, model dealer, um, Tay Models. Um, it was price tag for this is £140 uh, RTR. So that includes your uh, uh, transmitter, receiver, battery, and charger for the battery. Um, I got the brush version, which is the red one. Uh, the brushless version is blue, uh, but I wanted the brush version. If I want to convert at some point, I will. Um, no much of a difference between uh, the, the, the brushless and the brushed apart from the brushless being brushless and the brush being brushed uh, everything else is the same um, and only the color of the body shell change so uh, let's uh, open up this bad boy and uh, see what we got here right so ooh, nice it looks pretty, so I'll put it up in the box for you guys to see it. Let's see if I can. Uh, uh. Right, so here's the truck. We'll get this on the side. So here's the truck, it looks pretty good to me, uh, no bad articulation of, of the box, um, I, I like the, the, the body shell, it's got a nice detailing with the, with the driver and the co-pilot, co uh, you get a spare wheel which is actually a functional wheel so you can actually unscrew from here and put it back in there in case one of your tires or wheel breaks um, let's get the paperwork actually so paperwork we go uh, French I do not read French oh there's some uh, this is a notice about charging process update. So I have to read that. This is about the, the ESC. It's either in English or French. And then you get two manual books, which is kind of strange. Why are there two manual books? Okay, so one is a Instruction manual, notice and utilization. Okay, so this is pretty much basic, basically about uh, about your uh, Receiver and transmitter, or uh, if it's bind, how to bind it, and some of the other settings, which is a bit weird to have a different book. But so it looks like on this it comes the Etronics uh, transmitter, and this one. So this one is components and upgrade parts. Listening. So over here we have all. All of your parts, you guys can see that, and somewhere in here, usually it'll be the last page, should be upgrade part place. There it goes. So, all of this page is all about upgrades. So, there's a few interesting upgrades in here. Okay, so put that on the side. Get this box in here, which I believe will be the radio. Yeah. Oh, wait a minute. This is 
is not an electronics. This is a play scale. Okay, so in that manual, they had a, a, a e-tronics um, remote on the pictures, but you actually get a fly sky. I don't mind. I like fly sky. So actually, I think it's always better than the than the e-tronics ones. To be honest. So what else is in this box? We got the remote. We got the binding. Uh, I mean, and the battery charger, which is basically a, to me a charger. It's got a European um, adapter. So, let's put that on the side. And now, let's open up the truck. Take the bottom shell off, or bottom shell. No cage, all the same. Take it out. You guys can see. It's all in one. It's just got panels on the side. I like the detail on the, on the drivers. On the driver and the co-pilot. A bit of detailing on the dash, just there. I don't know if you guys can see it, just no, no, you see a little bit there. So, and here, you have the rolling chassis. Not a lot there, is it? As you guys can see. Okay. I was actually thinking this would be a lock diff, but it's not. Ah, good. Um, a big 550 motor, gross motor. That's your ESC. Which, um, fairness, in fairness, it doesn't look very promising. We'll see. Um, Waterproof um, um, servo, serial servo, which is good. I like the big bores, shocks, they look to be really nice. They look like they will handle the, the beating, but will the rest of the truck will handle the beating? That's the question, because I will be putting it to test. There's a lot of adjustable points on the upper arm and as well on the lower link as well you get a lot of adjustable points um, I wonder if that would possibly actually make them a bit slightly weaker in there we'll never know I think it'll be tested so suspension I like the suspension moves quite nicely um, Overall, it looks like a nice truck. Uh, those, I think, soft enough. They would not, if you want to use them for crawling. I don't think this would uh, would be the, the the tire to use. But I think for going a uh, uh, medium high speeds runs, it, it is actually it will hold quite well. So. You got, I believe those are 2.2 wheels and tires. Um, comes with a battery, which is attached. I'll bring you guys closer. So it's a neon battery, no lipo, unfortunately. Um, and I do not know if that can run lipo, in fairness. But if it doesn't, I've got something that I can change for. Um, so this is oh I like it okay so uh, no big battery I thought it was about uh, 3000 but no it's only a thousand eight hundred um, I'll just leave that for now 
comes with a cooling fin, which is quite cool. Um, let's see if we can take it out and have a look at this. Is that a 550? It doesn't really tell me how many tons is on it. It says it's a 550 motor. So, hmm, we'll see. Is it like that? No. So like that. Yeah, like that. So put the back in there. Um, so there it goes, guys. That's the FTX old claw. Um, as I said, I got this one off my local dealer, uh, T Models. Uh, you can check them out at uh, www.tmodels.com or uh, you can check them out at his Facebook page at T Models. Um, he's got plenty of those in there. They look awesome. I, I, I like them. They, they're pretty cool for the price. Uh, price tag is 140 as I said, I believe, I, I, I'm not sure if I mention it. It's 140 with your remote uh, battery and everything else that you need to run it. Um, fortunately, it, unfortunately for me, it comes with to me plugs, which I will have to change them. Um, uh, only because I don't really have... Uh, well, it comes with a charger for this, but I don't think I will be running this all the time because this will just be very short. So there it goes, guys. Uh, thank you for watching. Uh, please do let me know what you guys think about this truck. Um, would you personally get one? Or would you not even consider it? Thank you very much for watching guys, do please like, comment and subscribe for more upcoming videos on this truck. Thank you very much. Bye.